It is Monday, May 26, 2008, 4.24 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm in the Homewood Cemetery, located in the United States of America, in the state of Pennsylvania, in Pittsburgh, PA. This is one of the most appropriate places to be on Memorial Day, any Memorial Day, any year. Memorial Day may be a time for getting together with families and having picnics, as is the 4th of July. But Memorial Day is very specifically, I mean specific, and dedicated to those who served our country and who have died and who have died in battle. So it is appropriate that not only I have come to honor the dead who have fought for freedom in America for the past 232 years, but it is also appropriate that across America and around the world, people are honoring the American soldiers who fought for freedom and unfortunately died. But they gave their last measure, ma measure of devotion. They gave all that they had and more for the country of the United States. It is therefore our duty now to guarantee those who remain and who live, we must guarantee their freedom remains in this country and that the rights of all people and the civil rights and that all people have a fair chance in the race of life. The men and women who have served our military for the last 230 years have always fought for freedom. Many have died. They fought for freedom. They fought for you and they fought for me. And now we must honor them. We must thank them. We must appreciate them. But we must also honor them by continuing to fight legally and peacefully, but continuing to fight not only to keep America free from enemies who would harm us, but we must keep ourselves free from any laws that would take away our rights. We fight for freedom legally and peacefully. They fought terrible odds.